Hello, and welcome to my YouTube channel, Dan H2O. My name is Dan. With this being the first video of my channel, let me give you a little history about myself, my hobbies, and uh, what the main pointers of my YouTube channel is going to be about. I was born in 1981. I cur currently live just west of Lansing, Michigan, and I've been in the public service uh, departments pretty much all my life and I've been diving for at least three quarters of my life. Right out of high school I joined the Army National Guard. Uh, after that I was a firefighter, I was a correctional officer, and I was a lieutenant for a sheriff's office rescue and dive team. Uh, I began my diving career in 2002 while I was at the fire department. One of my good friends, Brent Corkwell, said, have you ever thought about being a diver? You talk about uh, National Geographic underwater. You talk about Jacques Cousteau a lot. You talk about uh, all these shipwrecks with all the gold down in Florida. You, you really want to get into shipwreck diving, don't you? I, I said, I'd love to do that. See some of them wonderful ships down there. So he ended up getting me my own set of equipment, uh, which is located somewhere back here in this plethora of mess I've got going on. Uh, so him and I have been diving throughout the years. Uh, we make it a point to go to the Great Lakes and dive some of our wonderful shipwrecks. Uh, because the Great Lakes are unsalted, uh, we have some of the best preserved shipwrecks in the entire world. I want to give a quick shout out to Kevin Ailes of Bangor, Michigan. He is the Southwest Michigan Underwater Preserve President as well as a council member for the Michigan Underwaters Preserve. Uh, he is a wealth of knowledge and has been a good friend of mine for quite some time. I will put a link in the description to the underwater preserves. Uh, that way it'll have information on the various shipwrecks that we have as well as the uh, GPS locations if you so choose to go out and dive them. In 2006 uh, the Sheriff's Department went around to all the different fire departments asking if there was any divers and if they wanted to join the rescue and recovery team. Uh, since I was already a shipwreck diver and had quite a number of thrills doing that, I figured why don't I step it up a notch. I raised my hand and I've been a public safety diver ever since. Uh, it's been fun. I've learned a lot of fi fascinating and fun things um, as well as had some ups and downs uh, with body recovery, etc., and uh, dealing with uh, people in their rough time of loss and loved ones. Um, it's not the greatest of uh, diving adventures sometimes, but the fact of knowing you're bringing someone's loved one home uh, is pretty much the driving force behind why I uh, raised my hand that day and became a diver. I've uh, since then made my way up to the rank of lieutenant for that dive team and I've stayed there ever since until 2018 uh, when my friends Jim Scholes, Darren Jilson, Don McElhaney, a couple others and I uh, decided to form the group Great Lakes Search and Recovery. Uh, we formed that group uh, with the purpose of being able to go around to the different uh, dive groups out there in the state of Michigan, hopefully uh, more outside the state, but for right now the state of Michigan, uh, and to aid them in searching and recovering uh, lost and missing persons. Uh, some different departments um, are held by the standard if they don't have enough evidence uh, they won't go looking or they won't continue their search. Uh, sometimes searches are suspended due to lack of funds. Um, sometimes searches are suspended because the officers are needed on the road patrolling instead of uh, in the water. Uh, because we are a state of Michigan government recognized entity, uh, we are able to go in uh, to those areas and work alongside those teams. Uh, to continue their efforts in bringing the lost person back to their loved ones. Uh, we are a 501c3 nonprofit. Uh, we are not paid for our time. We are a complete volunteer group. 
Um, if you've seen, uh, I think the other YouTube channel on here is called Adventures with Purpose. Uh, we do pretty much the same work that they do. Um, for now, that's about all I have. Uh, hit the notification bell. That way you'll get notified next time I post a video, which is hopefully pretty soon. Uh, go ahead. Feel free to make comments down below. I understand I'm probably not the best public speaker. That's one more thing I hope to accomplish with all these videos. Stay tuned, and I hope to take you on another adventure in the water, hopefully in my next video. Thank you, everybody, and have a great day.